एस वाई बी एस सी मैथमेटिक्स प्रैक्टिकल बेस्ड ऑन मैक्सिम सॉफ्टवेयर सो द फर्स्ट द फर्स्ट यूनिट इज वॉट सोल्यूशन ऑफ फालजे ब्राइक एंड ट्रांसडेंटल इक्वेशन सो द फर्स्ट एग्जाम्पल इज फाइंड द रियल रूट ऑफ द इक्वेशन एफ ऑफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स क्यूब माइनस एक्स माइनस वन इक्वल टू जीरो करेक्ट टू थ्री डेसीमल प्लेसेस यूजिंग बाय सेक्शन मेथड एंड मैक्सिम सॉफ्टवेयर सो द गिवन इक्वेशन इज एफ ऑफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स क्यूब माइनस एक्स माइनस वन सो वी नो दैट इफ एफ ऑफ ए इन टू एफ ऑफ बी इज लेस दैन जीरो देन देर एक्जिस्ट एक्स बिलोंग्स टू ओपन इंटरवल ए बी सच दैट एफ ऑफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू जीरो सो नो इन द गिवन एग्जाम्पल इफ यू कंसिडर यूर से इफ यू कंसिडर एफ ऑफ वन देन एफ ऑफ वन इज इक्वल टू वन माइनस वन माइनस वन इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन एंड एफ ऑफ टू इज इक्वल टू एट माइनस टू माइनस वन इज इक्वल टू फाइव सो एफ ऑफ वन इज लेस दैन जीरो एफ ऑफ टू इज ग्रेटर दैन जीरो सो दिस इम्प्लाइज एफ ऑफ वन इन टू एफ ऑफ टू इज लेस दैन जीरो एंड देर फोर आवर रूट लाई इन द इंटरवल वन टू नाउ इन द नेक्स्ट स्टेप फॉर द नेक्स्ट स्टेप वी कंसिडर हियर ए इज इक्वल टू से ए इज इक्वल टू वन b is equal to two, then c is equal to a plus b by two, and therefore c we get c is equal to one plus two divided by two is equal to one point five, and next we obtain the sine of f of one point five, then it is equal to if we solve this then f of one point five is equal to zero point seven eight zero point सॉरी जीरो पॉइंट एट सेवन फाइव एंड विच इज ग्रेटर दैन जीरो सो फ्रॉम द प्रीवियस स्टेप इफ यू ऑब्जर्व एफ ऑफ वन इज लेस दैन जीरो एंड एफ ऑफ वन पॉइंट फाइव इज ग्रेटर दैन जीरो सो फॉर द नेक्स्ट स्टेप आवर रूट लाइ फॉर दिस स्टेप आवर एक्स लाइ बिटवीन द इंटरवल वन टू वन पॉइंट फाइव सो द लेंथ ऑफ द इंटरवल इज रिड्यूस द ओरिजिनल लेंथ is you can see here x belongs to 1 2 okay here x is what x lie in 1 2 now our x lie in 1 and 1.5 so same step uh, you can apply for the next step we can again find here you can you can consider a is equal to 1 b is equal to 1.5 then c is equal to 1 plus 1.5 divided by 2 and then uh, then you will get it is equal to 1.25 Again, find the sine of f of one point two five. You will get it is equal to minus zero point two nine. Okay, minus zero point two nine, which is less than zero. And in the previous step, f of one point five, you can see here f of one point five is greater than zero. So our root lie between, and therefore, therefore root lie between. A one point two five and one point one point five. So the now again, again for the first step our root lie between one two. In the next step our root lie between one to one point five. And in the third step our root lie between one point two five to one point five. And if you continue so on, finally you will get the value of x. Which is correct up to three decimal places, and which is the root of the given uh, given uh, this equation f of x given function f of x. Now we are going to apply the Maxima software to solve uh, solve the given example. So here f of x is equal to f of x is equal to sorry, f of x is equal to x cube minus x minus one. Uh, sorry. Then, and if you find here f of one, uh, then f of one is minus one, and f of two is equal to f of two is five. 
so f of 1 uh, 1 into f of 2 is what less uh, you can see it is what less than 0 so our root lie between uh, x lie between uh, 1 and 2 so the next find the value of c so here c is equal to say c is equal to 1 plus or instead of c say here x1 x1 is equal to 1 plus 2 divided by 2 so it is equal to uh, okay we want 3 by 2 should be float so I think if you write here 2.0 that is x1 is what 1.5 now if you consider f of x1 the sign of f of x1 then it is equal to sorry want to write this as x1 is equal to 1.5 so f of x1 is equal to 0 0.7875 this is a positive and the last negative is what f of 1 that is minus 1 so root lie between so the root lie between 1 and 1.5 so you can check here f of 1 into f of 1.5 is equal to is what less than uh, less than 0 so the our for the next step x2 is equal to 1 plus 1 1.5 divided by 2.0 then we get x2 is equal to 1.25 again we want to assign this so instead of this i am writing here so x2 is 1.25 and if you find the value of f of x2 it is equal to which is negative and in the previous step that is here f of 1.5 is what positive so you you can see here if you find f of 1.25 root always lie between opposite signs so and f of 1.5 it is equal to which is less than 0 so the x3 is equal to x3 is equal to 1.25 plus 1.5 this whole divided by 2.0 sorry 2. Point, this whole divided by 2.0 so we get x3 is equal to 1.375 and again here we want to write x3 okay so x3 is equal to 1.375 so f of x3 is equal to positive so f of f of 1.375 is positive and out of this 1.25 and 1.5 you can see here f of 1.25 is negative so the for the next step our root lie between if you check here f of 1.375 star f of above next is what out of this this is positive so the last negative is what uh, the last negative was uh, f of uh, 1.25 you can check f of 1.25 is what negative so if you write here 1.25 you can see it is negative so the our for the next step say x4 for x4 it is equal to 1.375 uh, no first we want to write 1.25 1.25 1.375 1.375 plus 1.375 divided by 2.0 so it is equal to 1.3125 you can you can see here this the x3 and x4 are correct up to one decimal places so if you apply more step you will get the root correct up to three four decimal places so if you try to sorry if you try to find the sign of f of x4 f of x4 it is again negative so f of x4 is this is the f of x4 x this is f of x4 uh, x4 is this so but out of this now f of x3 is positive and this is negative so the root lie between x3 and x4 x3 and x4 so if you can check here f of 
x3 that is x3 is what f of x3 is uh, f of x is 1.375 1.375 star f of x4 which is equal to 1. Point, and it is negative so root lie between these two number and therefore x5 is equal to the addition of these two number control c p plus divided by 2.0 so it is equal to 1.3475 again if you apply the next step and you continue this step you will get the root correct up to three decimal places here we get x3 x4 and uh, x4 and x3 you can check x3 and x4 they are correct up to one decimal places now if you apply one more step say we are going to check one more step say x5 x5 is positive so the last negative is what f of x4 so the x6 is equal to x6 is equal to uh, 1.375 plus x5 and x4 1 1.3125 divided by 2.0 and then we get 1.32 okay so these are quite up to again one decimal place so if you continue uh, so on you will get the roots correct up to four three four decimal places thank you